Marie's getting the stuff that she bought today. Um, I have a story. I had um, that big Star Wars figure that I had, the Stormtrooper. So this guy came, and I'm telling him 10 bucks, and he's busting my chops. Oh, it's dirty. Blah, 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 blah. I said, yeah, I didn't get a chance to clean it, right? He wants to give me five for it, right? And then somebody come along, and I was telling him, oh, this guy was just busting my chops. I told him $10, because they were like, we were talking about how expensive toys were. And I said to him, guess how much I'm selling this thing for, 10 bucks. And the mother was like, I didn't know she was interested, right? But I said, I told the guy $7, he wouldn't buy it. And she was like, oh, you said $7? Because I'll buy it, but I'm like, okay, fine. And I See, that's it. what you get for saying something so cheap. I don't think she's going to Hello, dear. Uh, the Beatles, oh, $3, two for five. So we got four? Yeah. Looks like 10 bucks. Let's just measure. All right, I'll show what I got today. I buy from you every time I come here. Cool. Oh, I'm glad. You were out in the park. Were you in the park lot? Yeah, it was warmer. Last year, any year before that? Yeah, any year it's warmer, I'll be in the parking lot. Here's what I got. Uh, for ten dollars, me bought a little bit of jewelry. So much. But I bought. Bag. He needs a bag. Uh, you sure? I got a bag right here. Okay, thank you. Thank you. All right, so here's what I got then. While you're doing that. Three dollars, two for five. Okay, that's us doing business. All right, these are obviously like old Fenton, and these are like uh, this is a powder jar. That's cranberry glass. Cranberry like glass. Opalescent. Opalescent cranberry. And look, it has clear tops. I wouldn't have guessed that, but yeah. And then this is a perfume. I paid ten for the two. There's some chips here, but actually, they might not. Them either. That's a chip or not. But see how it's polished around it. Mm. So it might be. I'm no, not wearing my really good chips. glass. Well, I don't care about the stuff. So then, and, we're lucky but it to is have chips. Marie, Marie wants you to know that it's chipped. Everybody, <laughs> it's very important. I'll just get this over with. Will you? Okay. Here, here's all the great grand stuff that Marie bought today. What'd you pay? Uh, they were three for two dollars. Three for two dollars. I got us. A spider web with a little spider. I thought that was cool. It is cool. These two are MMA, which is Museum of Modern Art. What are you going to do with those? They're my case. Okay. Uh, this looks like the Toledo, Spain it does. stuff. does. And that one too. Uh, Hard Rock Cafe. Ooh. I think it's 1999. Do you want to look it up? Uh, Las is Vegas. It? I might have to go help. Uh, and then right. uh, the Rose. Okay. It, this is just flea market stuff. What? And you spent ten dollars right? no right. i spent six no it's two i spent four dollars oh nice okay i spent more than you ten all right let me go help aj bye give me the money well, they don't even match really um, no they're the same the lady thing. had another one she just found it no it's the but same they're thing they're all handmade so they're not gonna be exactly the same no, amount of white and stuff yeah no, but i'm just saying it's like they're, they're not an exact match but they're still nice i mean what do you think i should do with these should i put them online or? yes okay online i was thinking maybe the showcase I didn't see anything wrong with them, but I didn't put my glasses on, so hopefully, you know, uh, they're in good shape. Anyway, uh, surprise, surprise, the lady found another one, and I bought this. Only $3. This is my pickup. It's kind of late in the day. It's already like 2, but I wanted AJ to be here because AJ sold it to me, right? And why did you sell all this stuff it's to garbage. me? garbage. That AJ doesn't like garbage anymore. But actually, there's some decent it's stuff garbage. in there. How much you give me for? How much did I give you for everything? Twenty bucks. Twenty five. Twenty five dollars. Yeah, because this was ten. Yeah. AJ said, pick three dollars, two for five. So I said okay. So I looked through, and I picked these things, right? Uh, and so I'll tell you what I paid ten dollars for. This, these come in handy. I don't even need them. I got them all over the house. But uh, this, when Daryl, when you get out, and you start doing eBay again, I'm going to give this to you. I can always use these, you know. There was, I, it's worth like five bucks. I don't know how much this is worth, but this is probably a really yeah. good throw-in, right? Yeah. For like, uh, if I sell some, this is definitely a good throw-in. It's probably worth like five or eight yeah. bucks. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then this is probably like worth. Ten bucks. It is ten bucks. Look, it's got a little thing. Take that. That's Lego. I'm walking out like. Damn. You could sell that. Oh, <laughs> you don't want it. So then AJ was like, after I gave him ten bucks for this stuff, AJ was like, Give me fifteen for the rest. Well, you didn't do it at first. You were like, I don't want any of this stuff anymore, right? So what you were like, I'm gonna give you such a deal, right? And I'm like, ugh. But then he was like, he looked at everything, he said, Look, give me fifteen for everything, and I'm like, fine. And it's actually a decent deal because I could throw this stuff in. Yeah. And it, actually, if you need anything for like, a, if you sell a, a console yeah. and you want to fish something out, just grab it from here. So anyway, ham taro. Oh my God, Texas Hold'em. Uh, big Game Hunter. Can you give this to Daryl when he's out? Oh, I was going to give this to Daryl too. This is a 64. Does it work? It's a memory card. Oh, look what it says on it. This memory card is not a uh, sponsor. Right. Not sponsored. They want you to know that this is not a Nintendo product. What's that case? Yes. Empty. 
Another, this is an official 64 one. Uh, oh, look, there's another 64. They, they don't always work. Yeah, AJ thought this was pretty cool. Oh, wait, there is an SD. Wait a minute. No, there's another one. Well, can I use this for... Uh... You could. Where oh, because you, you had an R4, so you now could. it's got an SD card in it. Yeah, look. And there you go, because this, this is the adapter. There you go. Yeah, oh, there you go. Now all I gotta do is get a bunch of games yeah, to put on it. Yeah, now you can put on the games. Nice. So this probably came all together. Uh, Lord of the Rings, good throw-in game. Speed Gonzalez, throw-in game. Wolverine's Revenge, throw-in game. The Punisher is probably the movie, right? Uh, oh, the 64 tool. Oh yeah, that's actually that could come in handy. Game, I don't know, Game Boy uses. speaker. <laughs> I wouldn't have known that. Uh, Shark Tales. Let's see what else. These, you know, I never sell these. PSG. Okay, that's a good throw in. It's not really worth much, but this is actually my favorite thing at everything, and I'm probably going to keep it. It's a Super 88 and one. I might actually put it in a game. Bootleg Sonic? I'm actually probably going to put this in to my uh, whatever, and I'll see what games are on it. Because if you can read these freaking tiny letters, I'm trying to open it. See, AJ doesn't want junk anymore. Okay. Here, I'll do this. If you can read, wait, no glare. If you can read these tiny letters, that's all the games that are on this. Okay. And I might actually put this in a thing. Uh, and then what? Tetris. This is definitely a good throw in game. Um, these are BS, Dream Scene, Guitar Hero, My Sims, Big Brain, Guitar Hero, Pokemon. Is this like a movie? How many? Like 20 minutes? Did you watch it? Uh, World's Cup, throw-in game, Harry Potter, good throw-in, Rugrats for a while, Ed, Ed, and Eddie. I bet you Ed, Ed, and Eddie's fun. I should hook up my Game Boy uh, disc. Wait, you're messing it up. I don't know. Uh, SpongeBob, SpongeBob Show, uh, Stormbreaker, Tetris, good throw-in game, uh, Sega Game Gear, Little Mermaid. Did I ever tell you that my first cons handheld console was a Sega Game Gear? I didn't get a Nintendo. Snood. I never heard of that one. So for fifteen dollars, this is a good deal. I mean, there's a bunch of junk here, but whatever. Another memory card. Oh, is that is that Star Wars? Yeah. Oh, it's Empire Strikes Back. Asteroids. This is definitely a good throwing game. If I sell like a, uh, and then Desert Strike. That's it. That's everything. Uh, do you want this container back? Michael, give you his okay. ticket. Yeah. I got all the guys tickets. So, all this stuff I'm gonna go back in here. But now I'm gonna make a video where I show the games that are in here. So, and I'll just I'll just flip through them. Uh, and I'll, I'll pull this stuff out for Daryl later. It's because I have a bucket at home. I'll do it when I get home tonight. Okay. Not bad, right? 25 bucks. Hey, Jay. Yeah. What's the dumbest thing you did today? Nothing. Yes, it is. A, wait, I'm going to tell a story. So somebody offered AJ. No, 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 tell the whole story. You tell the whole story. It's your story. Somebody came and told me $50 for everything. $50 I said for no. everything. I would re refuse so that she also. She was looking through it. She told me 100 Okay. I said no. And AJ's then she was no. looking through it again and she goes, I'll give you 150 yeah, that's like on Family Guy. Remember when Peter was like, when they said, I'll give you everything you want and an extra $100,000, and Peter was like, no, like that. Remember that one? I thought yeah. when he did the, the, what was his, Anna Quackaducks, whatever it was. Yeah. Qua Anna Quacks, whatever, I can't remember. So AJ refused one hundred fifty. Now, here's the kicker in the story, AJ. Go ahead, tell. How much are you selling everything for? Three for five. So it's $2, dollars each, 3 for 5 So you think she saw something in here that might have been worth more than $100, right? But why didn't she buy it for two dollars, three for five? <laughs> Bravo. I was like, yeah. Bravo. <laughs> Bravo. <laughs> All right. Okay, there you go. But I might as well show my space. This is a weird space. Today, um, I got basically two, two 12 foot spaces. Um, so what I did was I didn't put out a lot of stuff. I did put out a lot of stuff, but I didn't put out everything. Um, I did a little thing in the back where I set up uh, one of the long, one of the shorter tables that doesn't fold, um, and then a square table. And I put the toys that I put out. I actually sold a couple of He-Man things today for kind of like ten bucks each, nine dollars each. Um, CDs. I only could get out seven trays of CDs. I only put out one thing of records, but people aren't really looking at the records. I put out some of these. Um, my four dollar three for ten toys. Um, with my space, I did my four long tables, and then um, I gave AJ my two short tables. AJ uh, managed to fit into my space today, and I put my two uh, tables that don't fold over there, where I have all my CDs. Uh, here's the games I have out. Nothing amazing. It's pretty much the same stuff. 
I did sell two of these, which is cool. Um, and so that's got some of my money back on the $200, like $20. Um, these games, pretty much the same. I'm sharing a case with AJ. Uh, NES, still haven't sold any NES. Uh, and I did bring, I had an NES that I thought might work, but the games were really messed up. It turns out that it kind of works. Uh, I tested six games on it, and five out of the six work. So I'm going to tell it, and I'll just talk to people. And I'm, I'm including uh, the Mario 1, 2, and 3 with it. So I'm probably going to try and get 60 to 75 bucks for that. Uh, so if it sells, I know for a fact those three games work worth on it. And those games would take somebody months or longer to, to beat. Um, we put out two tables of jewelry. Here's a case. Um, she's a little thinned out. She's been selling some of her stuff. Here's her uh, board, some of the stuff she laid flat, and then here's her necklaces on her shelf. Uh, I might as well show AJ space. AJ put out a bunch of consoles today that he just picked up. It was a good deal. Uh, here's his bin. This is his best stuff. This is that sweet pile of Mario games that he got. I'll give you half, whatever it is. I'm like, you just, like, don't worry about it. So He's got a nice, sweet selection of games. If he doesn't sell this this weekend, he'll probably put them on eBay. There you go. Yeah. He has a stack of PS4. I think he got the last week. It's on Wii U. Three dollars, two for five dollars. Okay. Uh, they mostly sell one to four dollars. So, you know, uh, there are every once in a while a rare one, but mostly one to four dollars. And then it, the bucket of toys that AJ has that he should have sold this morning for 100 You know, I started to count out how many toys were in there, and I got a feeling there was between 150 and at most $200. So, uh, again, he should have sold it, but whatever. AJ didn't listen. All right, that, so that's my space. And now, uh, oh, I did get a pickup, which I'll show before this. All right, AJ, what's the deal with this? Apparently, if you lick a Switch cartridge, it tastes disgusting. Because? Because they put a special coating for kids that have issues. Won't so they won't eat it and swallow it and choke yeah. to death. So are you going to lick it or no? I don't want to. But you will though, right? I, I think I should film you licking it. Nah, I'm not interested. No, but why though? <laughs> I have a lot of germs, AJ. I don't feel good. I, I lick it and I'll put my germs no, all over. No, I'll just wash it off. No, you won't. Do really you have antibacterial liquid? I just want Let me see. If you have antibacterial liquid on you. I can probably find Peralta. Somewhere. Exactly. Just what I thought. You don't have it. And <laughs> you're going to sell my germs to some poor person and I'm they're going to get you, sick you like me. It, I heard it's very bad. So go for it. Come on. I'm not, I'm not going to you, You're not going to die. You see the videos? Eat big Eric from up. Who ate Big Eric because he licked it? Yeah. I bet it tasted good, and he was just like pretending. I bet it tastes delicious. Well, what do you think? <laughs> We're talking about a game. <laughs> I was only talking about a game. Is that gross? So, what are you gonna do? All right. Well, I'll come back later when you decide. All right. Here's my Is that your whole Switch collection? No. Hey, he's going to show a Switch collection now. Go ahead. I have to open it up first. Yeah, that was my whole collection. It's still a Mario Odyssey and Smash in the console. But, like, these are, like, the games I played the most. Uh, I got to go. Bye. All right, so this is, it's, it says it's an 88 and 1 um, game cartridge. It's bootleg, probably out of China. It says Game Boy, like it's official. It's got a TM, Total Lie. And look at the oh, the slash through the the boy. Probably so they couldn't get sued or something. But I did try it on, test it before, and it did turn on. So let's see. I just want to show the games that are here. So here we go. I don't know, Net2 Cough. Sonic, it's got a Sonic one. I played actually one of the, um, I played the, one of the Mario games. But it's got Sonic, Aladdin, Mickey Mouse, Castle... Vania, two words, All-Star NBA, Seaside Valley, Burger Time, Pac-Man, Pinball, Super Mario Land. I played Super Mario Land. Seems weird, but um, it was pretty much like a bubble ghost. Uh, Battle City, City, Dr. Mario, Space Invaders, Motocross, Maniacs. <coughs> Master Karatika, <coughs> Tennis, Volley Fire, World Bowling, Tetris, Bomb Jack, uh, Hyper Load Runner. Alley Wax, Alley, oh, Alleyway, <laughs> Alley Wax, that's a weird name, it's like uh, the Brazilian, um, Suku Band 2, 
Shishishe show. Uh, Fleet po Flypole Street Fighter Mario Girlland. Mario Girlland. I might I might test that. Bomberman. Power Sonic. Uh, uh, Mickey Home. I think I'm gonna try Mario Girlland. Uh, 29. I'll test that in a second. Um, racing Damashi. Uh, oh, uh, Racing Damash 2. Super NBA Final Fighter Fight Tank Ultimate Tank Final Fantasy Beach Volley High Brick. All right. Uh, Power Man's. Uh, shouldn't it be Power Men or Power Man? Kirby Dreamland. Oh, that's a good one. Uh, Karundo Time in One. Netao Samurai Slam Dunk. Puyo 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 Puyo. That might be an interesting game. Grandair Goman. Gandair Ganbear Goman. GP Five Hundred. Dragon Fighter Superman Superman. Crazy NBA. Tank vs. Tank, Top Gun Super Mario 2, Pinball Dreams, NBA Jam, Double Dribble, World Cup, Double Dragon 3, Mario Dreams, Super Driving, Yakuman, Bubble Man, Lucky Mickey, Luck Mickey, Luck Mickey, <laughs> Luck Mickey, UFO Mario, uh, I want to do the, the girl Mario, I want to see that one, Air F-15, Tennis Pro, Star Invaders, NBA Basketball, King of King, Battle Tank, Little... Jenny, Home Alone, I, 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 Dorak Urin, what? Dorak Uret and Setu, Final Reverse, Pyramids of Ra, Mousetrap Hotel, Balloon Kid, Bubble Bobble, Bomber King, let's see, and uh, should it only, oh, okay, Mickey's Chase, Janta Kuboy, Janta Kuboy, uh, Tumble Pop, Top bank, Rank Tennis, Tetris Flash, Road Rash, McDonaldland and Dracula. All right, now let me see. I'm gonna go back to the other one. I'll do this all in one shot, and then maybe I'll see if I can. Power racing. Ah, you know I should I should have done this the other way. Master Karatek. Doctor Mario. Wait. Okay, I'll find this and I'll show it again. All right, I got the camera balanced on a coffee cup. So let's see if I can do this. I want to show the Mario Girl Land. Let's see what the Super Mario Land. All right, let's just see if it's a lie. Well, the screen's different. Oops. I don't know this one. Ooh, boy, this guy's tough. Got him. All right, let's see. I don't know, it doesn't seem to be Mario Girl. Let me see my goodness. I'm trying to see it in the screen, so a coin. Hmm. Alright, I mean it doesn't seem to be a girl, so alright. I'm turning it off. Just in case you were curious what Super Mario Girl M was like. Alright, uh, we're going to Clark. It's actually further than we thought it was, right? Uh, We're like forty five well, minutes it was away. Far, but I didn't know it was like yeah, it's like 40, 50 minutes. I think we left later than you said. Uh, you said I don't know. We left at 6.30. Whatever. It's, it's kind of far. Um, and I don't really know what our space is going to be like. AJ's squeezing in. Yeah. He's squeezing his stuff in. Um, and I'm supposed to get a breakfast and a lunch. Yeah, he says breakfast and lunch. Hey, I got your hot dog to share. <laughs> and they, they come in different colors. Light and brown. <laughs> Uh, like like we went to that place last week. It was like they had the hot dogs, and Adrian's like, I don't want to eat that. He's texting me now. I think. You what? The, you hear the ding ding? Yeah. Who else is texting me this time? I'll check it in a minute. Um, but we got to see. I mean, I'll I'll film the space to show what it's like. But I don't have a clue how much space they're going to give me. If they're going to be generous or not. They, I mean, supposedly. They're well, I don't out. think they can be. This yeah. is the time of year when a lot of. People have been calling them and they've been telling people they're full. Uh, Ellen said she actually had a, had a waiting list of 10 people. Yeah, so that's why they needed us to know. Yeah. I would have know when, if we were going to be inside or outside. I told AJ that he should probably, he should have maybe uh, set up outside. He would have had a lot of room. It's too cold. To be well, outside. it is cold, but his stuff that, like, they'll see right away and either they'll want it or they won't. That boy can't stay outside. He just sit in the car. You know what I mean? It is like if somebody wants to buy something, he'll just roll down the window. He'll probably his car, his Half battery his, will probably half die. Half his stuff will be dead. 
it will be his stolen battery will die. and his car will be damaged. Nah, it's too cold for, for people to steal shit. People are stealing shit at the malls now. They're like, I'm not going to the flea market to steal stuff. It's too cold. You know? Oh. You got, it's Thanks, hard to steal bro. stuff with gloves. Uh, right? You would imagine. But, all right, so we have to continue 1.5 miles now and then take exit 52 on right. But, but um, yeah, so we're going there. Um, hopefully the space will be decent. Hopefully we'll have an okay day. I, I don't know. Wait, you want to make a prediction? No. Marie hates when I make predictions. Don't. I'm going to predict $250. Stop. <laughs> and it's going to cost me $90 to set up And then there. I'm going to now I'm going to end up making like $245. <laughs> All right, I'm going to predict, I'm going to say between $250 and $400. That's my prediction. And we'll see what happens if I'm right. I actually gave myself a wide prediction. Whatever. Yeah, maybe I'll do better. You never know. Or maybe we'll be pleasantly surprised. Shut up, GPS. We know which way to go. Anyway, I'm out of here. Bye. Pot shots. I was like, what? <laughs> and then it's, it's, it's plant food nuggets. Yeah, I thought that was funny. Did you see the horse? <laughs> He's playing his... AJ, hey, what does this switch to? <laughs> Did it make the tail go up? <laughs> yeah, I think I thought that was pretty funny. <laughs> that doesn't seem to do anything, AJ. Hmm. Maybe it needs batteries. <laughs>